Well, g'day everybody and welcome back to Lumberjack's Dynasty. I can't remember ever putting that in. I can't remember ever putting that in. I must say that uh, for the very first time in uh, in this game's complete history, and we have been playing it from since day of uh, of release in early access, I have had the most nightmare time and the worst time trying to paint all of this and trying to get the rest of the house painted. Uh, reason being, I cannot paint this area here. There is nothing I can do on this area here. As much as I have tried, I cannot get any blue paint on there. Um, going through a whole lot of extra, extra paint um, that was sort of unnecessary um, by having those those paint hit boxes in the just in the wrong spot and stuff. But um, but there you go. See, uh, you can see here that I've had uh, some failures trying to get all of this done as well. I cannot paint any of this either. So. Uh, I don't know, maybe I have to go down below to get that painted. And uh, what's happened is the uh, is the little paint icons that come up when I'm, um, or the little repair icons, then uh, when I click on them, they end up painting the uh, the uh, the <clears throat> arcs around the, uh, around the doors and the windows. So I've had an absolute nightmare. It's the first time ever in the game that I have actually not enjoyed it, believe it or not. Now I've painted this door white, but uh, as you can see, it doesn't really it gives me the option to paint it, but it doesn't really uh, doesn't really make it any different. So there you go. So I have had quite a nightmare doing that, um, and as I said, it's the first time ever that uh, that I've ever suffered that that type of problem and stuff in there. So we've got some uh, some more painting to do there. I do need to get another uh, another thing of white. Uh, maybe we can run around here actually and. Um, and just have a little bit of a squeeze. No, so there's nothing under here to to do. I'm hoping that that stuff doesn't paint when I paint that uh, when I paint that porch, which we will do. I don't know what color I'm going to paint the porch in. Probably some sort of um, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. Uh, we better go in here and check. We have slept for the night, so we'll just go in here and we'll just check our water level here. Now I also have. Um, I also have a massive. I've loaded the truck up, ready to uh, to go up and do some more work on on those um, on those holiday units that we were working on. Uh, oh, there we go. The rain has started. Of course, it has. Uh, our sheep are, uh, are still. Our sheep, in fact, have disappeared. They're gone. They are gone. I don't know where they are. We have that big stack of wood over there of uh, wood pallets that I do need to get under cover as well. But uh, I've kind of I've kind of want to concentrate on trying to get some of this stuff done. We do need to do more painting on our barn as well. Our sheep have all come in here. There you go. Is that because it's raining? That's actually pretty awesome. So we're going to get some uh, we're going to get some milking done. Get all the milking done, and uh, then we will head up and, and continue on wor uh, continue working on these uh, these uh, holiday units that we are working on. So that we're thirty two percent through that quest at the moment. So uh, we're going to get ten thousand social points. Uh, I, d <laughs> I have people in chat. You know who you are in uh, in the comments. You know who you are. Rubbing it in that they've already married Lily. <laughs> <laughs> so I found that really, really amusing. Thanks for that. Um, <clears throat> yeah, because we could go over there and uh, try and chat Lily up if we wanted to and go on a date with her. I don't know. I don't know what to do, but we do need to look at getting married because, uh, you know, we, it is about it is about carrying on our dynasty, isn't it? So we'll, we'll see what we can do there. Don't know who it'll be. There's a chicken sticking its head through the, uh, through the back of the uh, chicken coop there. That's pretty cute. <laughs> Getting some cows milked. Look at those fancy shoes we're wearing. Has anybody ever noticed those fancy shoes? Got a little bit of uh, a little bit of tartan there, in amongst the black. They're pretty pretty fancy for work boots, I must say. I must say. We have got one more cow to milk. There we go. We'll get you milk. We'll collect the eggs, and then we'll head up and uh, we'll head up to do some more work on uh, on there. Sorry about that. I think a truck just a truck's just driven past and uh, it may have made some noise on the camera, although I don't know. Okay, they're all sitting in here because it is wet, so we probably won't be collecting. Uh, we can collect the eggs. Uh, I might leave it until maybe uh, if we don't pick them up, 
then the chances are that we may miss out on them. I don't know, so I better I better pick them up. Sorry. Stick my hand under there and steal all their eggs. Uh, there as well, and there as well, and there. Okay. Uh... All right, somebody did say that uh, they're, they're not having trouble with uh, mouse sensitivity. I did mention at one point that uh, that I was having trouble with mouse sensitivity and that I had to actually adjust it in my mouse software every time I play the game. Um, they say that they're adjusting the sensitivity on um, on the uh, uh, in the main menu now. I thought that maybe that um, maybe that might be because I have a I use a combination of a controller and a um, a controller and the mouse so um, when I adjust the sensitivity in the options it actually adjusts the sensitivity of the controller not the mouse so that may be a that may be a reason why for that now what have we got here we've got 48 eggs we've got 108 milk got some coffee there all right so we're gonna I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna head out uh, you're gonna have to chop that magic tree down again at some point uh, I am going to head up to um, up to our quest and continue on with our quest so i'll see you guys when i get up there okay here we are here we are everybody i noticed driving up here that everybody is uh, everybody's out at the moment uh, i mean everybody's inside at the moment because it's raining so which is uh which is very typical of everybody here to be doing that so let's uh let's jump out and we'll start doing some work on these and see what we can do about getting these done. I also wanted to just remove this. Uh, we're up, we're up here. I also just wanted to remove that star there, which was actually annoying the crappers out of me. So let's uh, let's grab some of that, and uh, we will continue to get these done because uh, this is what it's all about, isn't it? So I hope everybody is well. Um, I'm planning on hopefully uh, filming quite a few of these, a uh, few of these episodes. I'm um, I'm starting a new. I'm actually starting a new job, um, which is probably going to for the first couple of weeks of that uh, wear me out a little bit in the sense of you know there there may be a possibility that I don't get uh, quite as much done in regards to. Um, in regards to videos and stuff but i will continue to strive to to bring out as many videos as i can for you guys so uh and uh plenty of uh plenty of lumberjacks dynasty obviously as well i do need to get back in and do a farmer's dynasty too because uh, i am missing that greatly i am missing it greatly uh bringing some other some other bits and pieces to the channel as well i mean there's uh there it's really hard um it, it, it's been it's been quite difficult because uh, I would like to be a variety uh, a ver like a variety channel and I always kind of have maintained a little bit of variety. Uh, a lot of you guys are here I think for uh, for the simulation stuff for, for Lumberjack's Dynasty. Um, you know, people are really enjoying the uh, the ranch sim and stuff like that. But uh, there are other stuff that I'm doing like uh, I released an Urtech uh, an Urtuk um today and uh and that's one of that's another one of the things that i had, that i actually just uh you know some of that stuff that i absolutely love playing and that i would like to release on the channel as well it doesn't mean that uh it doesn't mean that all the stuff that you guys just uh, that you guys are, are here for is uh, is going to disappear because it's not uh, I'm still going to maintain all of this stuff as uh, more of a primary focus, but I am going to start releasing um, releasing a little bit more of, uh, of of the other stuff. You know, I want to do some more airport CEO, which is uh, which is actually pretty awesome. I'm really enjoying that, so uh, I really want to get into that. I do like playing those games, so I am going to do a little bit of variety, but I'm always always going to maintain um the uh my my dynasty series and my simulation series stuff that i am doing so there we go we've got two left so we'll do that up there with those two so that we don't uh miss out on those let's grab those there we go and we'll continue on with that yeah so it, you know that there, there will be a little bit more variety and stuff like that coming through um this year but um it, it's because i do enjoy playing other games so much you know survival games management games i love any type of management game they're they're absolutely fantastic to play which is where i like uh which is where i'm enjoying um uh airport ceo um 
Uh, yeah, a little, <laughs> a little bit of a variety. Definitely a little bit of a variety there. But uh, you know, I hope you guys are. I hope you guys are fine with that. Um, and it, it would be really good if you could just uh, if if you could give that a bit of a watch and uh, and uh, hopefully enjoy some of that stuff as well. Uh, I know it's a little bit outside of the uh, simulation genre that most of you guys are here to watch, but uh, it's still gaming, isn't it? And what are we here for? We're here for gaming uh, because we enjoy playing games, and uh, I, I certainly get a lot out of playing games. Uh, let's see. There we go. We'll do that. Um, get you done. I also wanted to talk about Microsoft Flight Simulator because... Um, um, I've, I've, I'm not releasing, I'm not releasing any episodes of, or, or filming any episodes of Microsoft Flight Simulator at the moment. Um, the reason being is I've been having technical difficulties, and it's been taking every time I contact Microsoft about it, uh, their support, then uh, they it takes them, a, you know, like six to ten days to get back to me each time I contact them, and they'll get back to me with a link to a forum on uh you know how to fix this and i'll do all that that's explained on the forum and it won't work so i'll contact them again and i'll explain to them that uh that i've done what they've uh, you know that i followed their link in their previous uh, in their previous suggestions and stuff and it didn't work i've done everything on there i've done reinstalls and all that type of stuff and uh the problem is still not solved and they will actually and I'll explain all of that in the next the next time I contact them, and they'll actually send me. Oh crap! I, I wasn't wasn't concentrating, and they'll send me another response to that with exactly the same response as the previous one, sending me to exactly the same forum and exactly the same suggestions. And they're just not interested in helping me out. And for that reason, then I've pretty well abandoned flying flight sim on my channel. And that is the reason why I haven't sent any of those out because I don't think that uh, I don't think that it's a uh, you know it's it, it it's it's like banging your head against a brick wall. I mean, I, you know, we've we've all done it before. Um, just getting nowhere. Uh, lots and lots of time sending and re rewriting and writing emails and re-explaining that yes, I've tried this. Yes, I've done that. Yes, I've done this and. Um, uh, and and just just to get the, exactly the same response, it's like there's just a bunch of people in uh, in um, in uh, Microsoft's help uh, on their help desk and uh, and the, on their tech side and stuff that are that are all they do is they just copy and paste, they just copy and paste links. Um, you know, they look up a database, somebody says a word, um, and they look up a database and. They they find the the most appropriate forum response where uh, where all of their uh, all of their community has has worked out the problems for them and they just send you to that link and that's it and that's all you get so um, so for that reason that's why I've kind of stopped doing that stuff as well uh, because it does get it does get frustrating after a while and you know I've had months and months and months of trying to sort those problems out and uh, not getting anywhere, just getting sent to the same thing over and over and over and over again. So, you know, I appreciate Microsoft giving me, giving the channel uh, a key and an opportunity to, um, um, to showcase their game and stuff. But, you know, I don't think that kind of um, support is, uh, is anywhere near good enough, especially for such a large company who should have a really good support system in place and they don't. So, you know, I can contact a, uh, a small developer, a small developing team about, uh, about, uh, about an issue on a game that I might have and they'll respond to me. They'll per they'll, I mean, I, look, I understand, okay, well, you know, Microsoft probably have, you know, two, three hundred thousand queries a day on their help channel on their uh, on in their support uh, in their support channels and on their support line and stuff but uh, so they may not be able to respond but they are also a lot larger than a lot of the smaller companies that uh, that we all deal with when we're um, when we're dealing with these games and we actually get responses out of these smaller companies personal responses mind you personal responses that uh, help you sort their uh, sort these out because because they are interested in making sure that um, that people get to experience their game fully um, and get the most enjoyment out of their game so 
Um, so yeah, sort of moving uh, moved away from uh, moved away from Microsoft Flight Simulator, and that's the reason why you haven't seen it on the channel at all. Um, so there you go. Now we will. Uh, I will also. I will, let's see. Let's get these. Uh, I know I'm rambling a little bit, but uh, but I thought I might sort of talk about a few th a few of these things with you guys. Um, uh, now, Farmer's Dynasty. I need to get back into Farmer's Dynasty. Um, I need to. I need to record some episodes. Hopefully, I'll be able to record some episodes uh, of that as well. Uh, I did my first stream on YouTube on Saturday night. Um, I wasn't ever planning on streaming on YouTube, but uh, but I did quite enjoy it, and uh, hopefully I will be splitting my streaming between YouTube and uh, and Twitch. I will still maintain my uh, my my Twitch streaming schedule, hopefully, um, because uh, because I do you know we do have an awesome community over there. Uh, what have we got? Sixty eight left. An absolutely awesome community over there on Twitch, who are also part of the YouTube community as well. But uh, um, but I will hopefully be able to start throwing a few more uh, a few more live streams on um, on YouTube. So if you want to catch up with those live streams, please make sure that you uh, that you have the um, the the bell. Um, the little bell icon icon clicked um, so that you get notifications and so that you're aware of uh, when those streams are actually scheduled so I usually schedule them maybe an hour or so before the stream starts sometimes a couple of hours um, one of the beauties of streaming on YouTube is that you can actually schedule a stream one two three four five even a week ahead of, of actually doing that stream, which is pretty cool. I, I actually really liked that idea. Um, so there's a lot more set up on, uh, you know, if, if I stream on Twitch, uh, I, I press a button, you know, I set my game up, I press a button to go live, and boom, I'm streaming. Uh, there's a lot more uh, set up in YouTube to set a stream up. Uh, it takes you a good maybe 30 minutes or so to actually uh, to actually set up a, a proper stream. Um, so yeah, so it's 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 quite interesting the difference there. But uh, hopefully, hopefully I'll be getting more of that done. So keep your eye out for that. I didn't stream for very long on uh, on Saturday night. Uh, I streamed a bit of Valheim. And to be honest, uh, Hokey Pokey and I have been a little bit addicted to Valheim. Uh, that's all I've been streaming lately um, is um, uh, is Valheim uh, playing with Hokey Pokey and uh, when she's not on uh, continuing those streams once she goes offline. But um, yeah, it's it's been one of those games that's been uh, considerably addictive to be honest, uh, and still enjoying it. Only through the second boss on that, so there's still so much more to go on that. But uh, I do need to sort of change my streaming up and stuff. I'm just trying to work out what uh, what kind of games are going to appeal to people to stream. I don't want to stream anything like Lumberjack's Dynasty or Farmer's Dynasty because uh, those games are uh, they're kind of special games that I would rather leave for uh, for the whole YouTube. Uh, for the whole YouTube series and stuff. I mean, this is this is actually episode number sixty nine of um, of Lumberjack's Dynasty. Believe it or not, you know, sixty nine episodes. That's uh, the longest series that I've done. It, it may not be the longest series that I'll ever do, because I may actually do um, I may actually do some series that are longer. But um, yeah, sixty nine episodes. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see, I've got that, that's what I've missed there, I got a little bit worried there, I thought I might have, um, I thought I might have missed something, alright, so, that takes us, that, that completes this job, and that takes us down to our next one, which is actually over here where our old pickup is, which is interesting, so, uh, so that's pretty cool, we've got that done, uh, we also need 100 apples and, uh, milk and eggs so we need to consider what we've got we've got 48 we've got 100 milk uh we need 100 apples i don't know whether we <laughs> i don't know what you guys think 
whether or not we uh, whether or not we go and uh, oh okay really don't want to do that uh, get the chainsaw out uh, I don't know what you guys think as to whether we go around and maybe pick some apples and stuff whether we buy some apples or something to 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 um, to do that so but uh, let me know what you think what you think we should do whether we should buy apples whether we should uh, whether we should actually uh, wait for our orchard to grow another couple of times to get a hundred apples I think it's going to take a, a bit to get a hundred apples or we could get, we could start going around and picking some of the uh, apple orchards and the apples that we don't actually get uh, get to pick uh, or, or that aren't aren't ever picked on the on the in the game you know by the uh, uh, by the NPC so we could uh, we could go that possibility as well if you guys think that that's a possibility let me know what you think let me know what you think in the comments below obviously all right let's uh, move over to where our next job is uh, we'll move over the oh sorry sir sorry sir I'll move over to there and we'll uh, we'll drop this stuff off and uh, we may look at doing something else I think we've got our chickens done we've got our uh, actually we might just drop into the store here and perhaps buy some apples uh, what, what was it? It was milk, eggs, and apples. So we might actually just drop in here and buy some at the store here as well while we're here. At least the store owners are. Uh, at least the store owners are, um, are still out and about uh, running their stores when it's raining. So that's pretty cool. I uh, don't want to sell any milk off or anything. Hello, Annette. Hi there. Can I help you? Yes, you can. Care to trade? Uh, let's see. Uh, no apples. They've got no apples at all. I might. Uh, I might buy all of the zucchini so we can do some more meals. I might buy all of those. I uh, won't buy anything else. We'll buy the honey. Somebody did mention. Oh, why aren't you buying the honey? You should be buying the honey. Well, it's true. I probably should be buying all of the honey off all of these guys. Thank you very much, Annette. Lovely. Oh, there's that beast over there now we can get quests for um to be able to get hold of that machinery i'm hoping that i will be able to get hold of do some of those quests in the future get hold of that machinery and uh i'm probably i'm not going to do anything i'm not going to repaint any of it or anything like that i'm going to uh i think i'm just going to proudly display it somewhere around the lumber mill that's my plan anyway all right i will see you guys when i uh get over there this is just down the road here is uh, on the right here is uh, is where our date was just to the left there she was in that house there that's where we first met her so uh, we will probably have to uh, go and chat to her at some point go and chat to her at some point okay I think it's just uh, take a right here oh, there's that mountain road that mountain road's pretty cool. I think I think this one might be up here. Yeah, it is. Is this is this to repair the motel? Uh, let's see. Let's get up here. Ah, here we go. This is yeah. This is where the Ute is. Uh, we'll drop into this store as well while we're up here. That's where I got the inspiration for my house from. Uh, I really loved uh, a blue house. I really really loved a blue house. What's this place over here? Oh yeah, there's some more holiday units here. Awesome. Uh, is there somewhere we can get in behind and uh, and park our truck? There's only like two here, so that probably won't take long to do, will it? Uh, let's run that out because that will be the first one that we will do, I think. Can we get out? Yes, we can. All right, so that'll be uh, that'll that'll do. Uh, we've got plenty on board to do that, which is good. I don't know whether we're going to have to repair that. I don't know whether we're going to have to repair this over here either. Jeez, it's quiet, isn't it? There's nobody around gossiping when it's raining, is there? Nobody at all, but uh, I'm not sure how many other uh, holiday units there are. I think that... Ah, oh, look, there's a whole pile over here. I missed those ones, didn't I? So probably going to have to do those, which means we're going to need another load as well. I don't know whether part of it is fixing up the motel. I know that we've done some work on this motel, repairing it and stuff, but we haven't uh, done anything else on it. So, which brings me to uh, the question: I wonder whether there's actually going to be uh, look, that's all painted over there. I wonder whether there's actually going to be paint jobs and stuff 
uh, jobs to do painting and stuff uh, in the future as well, or whether they're already in it as well. Hi, Hello. Victoria. How are you? <laughs> I'm good, thank Care you. Care to trade? Okay, what's she got? So we'll have uh, we'll have all of that honey. Thank you very much. So we'll buy that. We'll have all of those tomatoes. We'll have those, and we will have the pumpkins as well. So it allows us to make meals and stuff. We do need to also start. Uh, thank you very much. Start storing stuff in. Um, uh, in our, she's got pants on like Lily. Doesn't Lily have those pants? No, Lily has a skirt on. Lily has a skirt on. Um, oh, that's an interesting colour, isn't it? That barn actually looks really nice. They do need to go and do some. Let's let's go and sneak in and have a look here. Oh, look, people are out and about. Um, that's actually that that actually looks really really good. Needs that trim done, probably in the same colour as what the doors are. Let's go and have a chat. You, this is isn't this the uh, hello? Yes, it Hi is. There. This is the uh, deputy mayor's wife, isn't it? Uh, Need me to help you with something? Not now. Sorry. Okay, that's fine. Is there any new rumors? Any new rumors flying around? I heard poachers are scaring the animals off. Old Logan just can't deal with them all by himself, no matter how good a man he is. All right. Go. So there might be some uh, there might be some poachy poachy work in there to do at some point in time as well, which will actually be pretty cool. So let's uh, close that off. And uh, the old Ute now. I thought we painted. I thought we painted. No, we didn't paint that because we couldn't paint that at that particular point in time, could we? That's right. I'm pretty sure that we couldn't. Let's uh, let's see if we can sort of make our way back home. We. I also need to do some more um, some more lumberjacking, obviously, as well as some more uh, as well as some more woodwork and stuff like that. I do want to. Um, I do want to sort of have a have a squiz around and see if I can see anybody else around as well. That would be pretty cool. Let's head, let's head down this way. I don't want to go around the windy road. I don't think we'll see anybody around the windy road. Although there may be some uh, resort stuff to do up there. I can't remember. It was so many episodes ago that we went up there. So, um, but what I am going to do, guys, is I am going to leave this episode here. It's a little bit short and sharp. It may turn out to be about thirty minutes. I don't know. Uh, so I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to let me know what you think about uh, those things. Um, are you interested in coming and, uh, or, or are you going? Are you planning on coming and joining us on, um, uh, joining me if I stream on YouTube uh, and all that type of stuff? And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.